Hi there, this is Jennifer with Brome Fields and today is day 13 of our 21 days of cable knit stitches. And today's stitch is a seed stitch horseshoe cable, which is the same name from yesterday's stitch. So maybe I need to come up with something a little more clever. So this here, it to me, this looks more like a horseshoe than the one from yesterday. So I might come up with something a little more clever for that. Um, this is a 12, nope, 10 row repeat. And I did it a little different because I needed this beginner, this beginning edge to be a little cleaner um, because it just started right off with a cable. So I added a few rows to the beginning. So it lays a little flatter and then we'll add these same rows to the end. So whenever they'll butt up nicely. So I have only one cable on here. So this one's an easy one um, today. We have this lovely seed stitch, which gives it a great texture. Um, I am using paint box yarns today. It's a super bulky, super chunky is what they're gonna call it. And they're recommending a size 15 knitting, knitting needle. I'm using a size 11 um, because I like it, uh, my cable uh, headbands to be a little tighter. Just the headbands in, seem, tend to um, loosen up over time. So I want it a little tighter so I can wear them a little longer. Um, I only have one row to show you. I'm going to show you row four. That's our cable row. So there's a couple of uh, stocking net rows before I do the cable. So it makes it a little cleaner edge and it gives it more definition to where that the, the seed stitch is. It's kind of like the uh, medallion without uh, closing it off with the circle. All right, so let's get started on row four here. So I am going to, oh, I don't have my, I forgot to knit into that stitch there. So I'm going to slip one purl wise and then purl this first stitch, which is the gutter stitch. And then we're going to cable six back. So it's two cable stitches side by side and right laning and left laning. So we're going to slip three stitches off and hold it into the back of our work. Knit three stitches off of our left hand needle. And then we're going to knit three off of the cable needle. And it's a little tight. And then the next one, we're going to knit one stitch. And then we're gonna do the cable six front. So with our right hand needle in the back, we're gonna slip three stitches off. And knit three stitches off our left hand needle. And slide that forward so we don't lose those stitches. And knit three stitches off of our cable needle. And then we're going to purl one, which is our border stitch and with the yarn in front, slip one purl wise. All right, and then after you uh, knit a couple more rows that will loosen up a bit and look more like this one here. So I'll knit a couple more rows and then take some pictures. So that is it for day 13. That is a pretty easy stitch. Uh, one cable in a 10 row repeat. So not, um, not too many cables on the headband, maybe six or seven. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's stitch and I will see you tomorrow for day 14.